time to learn how to pick up girls at a bar again from our friends at Expert Village. Today we'll be learning how to break up a conversation. As you can see, our protagonist has spotted his target in a conversation with another guy. He's being cock-blocked, but soon the cock block -e will become the cock-blocker. Let's learn. Hi guys, I'm Alex McRae. What do you do if the woman you're interested in is already in the conversation with someone else? Go home and cry. That's about it, Alex. Why? Is there another way of handling this situation? Start talking to everyone in the group. And make sure that one thing you say to the group is an open-ended question. Hey guys, I was wondering, I'm planning on making a trip abroad, but I'm really not sure to go, where to go. Um, what are some interesting places that you've been? Not bad, pretty natural. Fucking Alex stiff-arming his way in there, pushing heads out of the way. Hey, hey, excuse me, pussies, I'm trying to travel. Where have you assholes been? Honestly, you could skip all the steps here. If you go check out twitch.tv slash moistcritical and follow, girls love that shit. They can smell when someone follows my stream, and they love it. Well, I went to Italy last year, and I loved it. At this point in the conversation, you found out something specific and interesting. Gotta disagree, Alex. Not only is that not interesting, I don't think it'd play out this way. If you ask a group of strangers at a bar where you should study abroad, they'll probably tell you to go fuck yourself and do your own research and maybe to shave your soul patch. Hey, Italy. That sounds really awesome. I've never been, but I, I want to hear more about it. Absolutely. From this point, the conversation is more between you and her. And everyone's comfortable, and you can have a fun interaction. This actually works really well as a wingman tutorial by having you come over and be like super weird and boring. You make the guy she was talking to look a lot more interesting in comparison. Except in that case, you might as well double down, like interrupt them like, Hey, have you seen my jar of farts or something? And then like walk away. I think Alex should do a tutorial on that next time on how to be a wingman. But this guy's an alpha male. He'd never wingman somebody. He's got more tutorials. Let's check out some more. If a hot girl were to walk by... Hmm, okay, you come in your pants. That's what that looked like there. Fucking Alex here turning around like an android trying to track her. This conveys several things. First of all, now she knows you exist. For two people to meet, they have to recognize that they're in the same room. Well, he's not wrong there. She certainly took note of that. I mean, like, yeah, everyone's gonna fucking notice that, but not in a positive way, Alex. You just sit there creaming your pants. Not only will she know you exist, she's gonna smell you exist because you just blew some baby gravy all over your boxers. Remembering a person's name is a key part to every conversation. At some point, I'm going to learn her name. Say her name is Mary. Mary, 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 Mary. What can I connect? Well, she does have nice hair. Harry Mary. Well, can't argue with the results. That's certainly one way of doing that. The phone number. I want to make sure that I have her number and also that she has my number. Well, no shit. Now, the way I do this is using my phone. Hey, I really enjoyed talking to you. Yeah, me too. So, why don't you put it in your number and call it and then you'll have my number. Honestly, nothing to critique there, just a classic strategy. Hey, just put your number in my phone, then call it, and please don't go to my photos. I see a lot of pictures of my penis, and I just, you know, I wouldn't want you to go over there, you know, venture into that area of my phone. All right. Let me see. All right, I've got it in there. Great. And my last name's McRae. It's actually Scottish. So actually, actually, just, just type in, uh, cute Scottish guy. Okay. Great. And that's Checkmate, Turbo Virgins. Alex is going to be slamming and ramming real soon, baby. Now you've learned how to interrupt the conversation, how to smile, make eye contact, and how to get the number to seal a deal for the later coitus. Fuck yeah, Alex. Thank you for the tutorial, and thank you, Expert Village. See ya.